it's your boy books and i'm back with another tutorial for you guys today i'm going to be showing you guys how to perform special layups or should i say signature layups in nba 2k20 mobile a lot of you guys have been asking me to make a layup tutorial but i've done so many of those since like 2k17 mobile and i even did one last year for 2k19 mobile and as far as i know the controls of the game have not changed the layups are pretty much the same so if you want a full layup tutorial for this game just check out my 2k19 mobile layup tutorial i'll leave a link in the description and the comment section down below you guys can check it out so you can find all the basic layups on that video but today i'm going to be showing you guys how to do special layups a lot of you guys have been seeing me doing the shake and bake also i recently discovered how to do rondo signature layup the rondo fake so i'm going to be showing you guys today how to do it and also the 360 layup as well so many of you guys have been asking me so without wasting any more time let's just get straight into it so the first thing you want to do is obviously you have to buy and equip the layup so all you have to do is just head on to my career go to the upgrade section and then underneath you should see the animations and you want to click on the layup animations and now you should see a list of so many layup packages now you can buy and equip the layup package you want to use as you can see we have the hardened layup package we have the westbrook one they're currently locked for me because i haven't completed the connections we even got the jordan one over here these are not the ones i'm going to be focusing on if you guys want to use those ones you can just equip them they're standard layups so they're very easy to trigger but the ones i'm going to be showing you guys are all situational layup they only trigger at certain angles and with certain moves so as you can see i've already equipped the rondo layup package so what you want to do is just head on to the practice section or the my court then you can practice the layup over here now how to do the rondo fake it's pretty simple and it's basically a reverse layup so what you want to do is while it's driving from the baseline you want to stop sprinting so just bring the left stick back a little bit and next up you want to hold the right stick upwards and your player is going to go into the rondo fake animation it looks pretty smooth i'm not gonna lie i'm gonna do it from the other side so you guys can see it as well it's a nice layup you just need to be driving baseline release your hand from the turbo so just slow down a little bit and now hold the right stick upwards it doesn't always trigger sometimes your player is going to do a reverse layup but when it does it looks pretty smooth so now i'm going to be doing it in the match as well so you guys can see it and how it's applied it's just the same thing but it's harder when the player is in front of you but if you're able to shift him or he's coming close to you you just have to hold the right stick upwards slow down then you complete the rondo fake next up i'm going to be showing you guys how to do the shake and bake or the jamal crawford layup package so it's the same thing as well you want to buy and equip the layup the only difference is to complete this layup you need a defender to be in front of you so you can't practice it like the rondo fake when you're alone in the mic or you need a defender to be in front of you before this animation is going to trigger but if you want to practice on the mic or it's basically a hop step layup while driving to the rim you want to hold the right stick either to the right or to the left then you complete a hop step layup the only difference is to do this layup you need a defender to be in front of you and i chose the perfect defender to practice on james harden <laughs> so while driving to the rim if the defender is backing off or the defender is waiting for you in the paint you want to hold the right stick either to the right or to the left and your player is going to complete the shake and bake like the rondo fake this animation is not always going to trigger but when it does you're sure going to shift your defender and make him look silly as you guys know i've been doing this layup so many times in my my career videos i even recently did it with my big man as well so you can do it with big men too it's pretty smooth last but not least we're going to be looking at the monte ellis layup the 360 layup now i'm not going to lie to you guys i tried doing this layup so many times i just cannot pull it off but i know it's possible because i've seen so many clips of you guys doing it when i used to upload videos of my top five plays a lot of you guys send me clips of you doing the 360 layup a lot of you guys were using mods to play the game as well so i don't know if that's what made you trigger the layup but all i basically know is it's a reverse layup as well you have to be sprinting to the rim from the baseline there needs to be a defender in front of you a defender in the paint the animation is gonna trigger i tried so many times for like 30 minutes it just didn't work man closest i got to doing the layup was like doing a spin layup basically i just couldn't trigger it but if you guys know how to do it very easy let me know in the comment section down below i'll be sure to make another video and shout you out as well so yeah these are how you do special layups in nba 2k20 mobile you just have to buy them and for most of them just hope for the best basically <laughs> anyway it's been your boy books be sure to drop a like if this video helps you out share it as well also subscribe to the channel if you're new we just hit 65k man that's crazy we're on the grind man i'll see you guys on the next one stay bookmarked Yuck. You're wasting the clock again. Another horrible possession. Oh, how do you break your ankles? Wait, what? This game. I'm just speechless right now. I don't know what's going on. I gotta get some revenge for my dog, though. Let's size him up. Oh, God, I'm with the cross. I'm pulling this. Yuck. Right back at it. 